Welcome to the Sympologists channel. So I've made a few videos uh, up to now, uh, showing you guys how to make a simple layout for a warehouse using Excel. Other times I used Excel to solve or supplement of Excel to do some route planning uh, using DLP uh, simplex methods. So I've used uh, especially the Excel software in, the, in a few of our videos here. But for a, a startup company or a small business, uh, sometimes uh, software can cost a lot. So I would like to give you a few tips about, about softwares for logistics that cost uh, nothing or uh, sometimes very little. So the first thing is you need a good spreadsheet system. So Excel is of course one of the best options in the market, if not the best. But there are other options which cost uh, far less. And if you are a startup company or a small company, maybe you can look into those uh, free alternatives and start with them and then uh, with uh, time uh, move to, to other solutions. Uh, so I will show you, if not all, at least most of these solutions I have used or I continue using myself. So they all work very well. They have the same resources as the, the main softwares in the market. It's just uh, that you have to research a little bit more and uh, uh, there, is, uh, there are less uh, users for this kind of software. So sometimes to, to exchange uh, files, this kind of thing can get a little bit messy. But overall, you can live uh, with this and you can be productive. And uh, most of all, you will save a lot uh, on software. So without further ado, let me show you some of the, the softwares that I want you guys to see. So the first is the Google Sheets software. It's pretty much like Excel, only it's online. So you can make all your, all your spreadsheets online. It has pretty much the same resources as the Microsoft Excel. Uh, it's free to use if you are, if you are a one person company and you can always uh, pay for, for a Google company account and then you can use all, all of their software. Uh, Google solutions are always very good. They are tightly neat with um, the Google Drive, for example. So it's a very, very elegant, very good solution. Uh, I recommend this for you if you don't already have a Microsoft Office package, then you can move all your documents to the, the Google solutions. Uh, there is not only the, the uh, spreadsheet solution, they have other softwares they are all online and they are all very easy to use. The interface, the look and feel is very close and resembling the, the Excel and the, the Microsoft Office softwares. So it's not a big jump uh, from your, you know, the most uh, used uh, softwares to the Google uh, solutions. Uh, another solution is uh, for OS. I use in most of my computers the Ubuntu a version of Linux. The Ubuntu distribution is probably the most, the most influential uh, distribution of Linux. The, it has the bigger uh, user base and uh, it's very good, very stable. Linux has a lot of software uh, ready for it. So you won't miss anything if you are using uh, Linux. So I, I really uh, recommend using it 
you're going to save a lot on software and you can do pretty much everything. Uh, if you are using Linux as your operational system, you can use LibreOffice instead of the Microsoft Office. So uh, it's a freeware and you have pretty much the same uh, software that you have in the Office, Microsoft Office package. So you have a word processor, a spreadsheet, a software for presentations, database, and everything else. So it's really good to use, easy to use. There are some problems of compatibility uh, between the documents created in LibreOffice and, and when you try to read inside um, uh, the Microsoft Office. But overall, uh, it's very usable, uh, very good. I use on a day-to-day -day basis. I create most of my presentations and my classes uh, using the LibreOffice. And then I save the files as a PDF file and I upload uh, in the Google Drive or some other cloud uh, to share with my students. So I, I do recommend these. Uh, they are re really useful. They are easy to use and they are very stable. And for logistics, you know, to manage fleets, uh, manage deliveries, you also have softwares written for Linux and they cost a lot less than softwares uh, written for other uh, platforms. So uh, you should really uh, take a look. Uh, sometimes the, the Linux software, the, the, the look and feel or the interface is not as pretty as the interface of so other softwares uh, created for Windows, for example but they uh, have several advantages. You know, uh, Linux is usually more stable, is less susceptible to viruses. Um, so overall, uh, I think it's a, a good investment, you know, to invest in, in hardware, for example, and uh, use uh, a mostly freeware uh, software like Linux, and uh, purchase whatever specialist software you need. Like in my case, I, I, I work with logistics, then I need some uh, logistics related software that you cannot find uh, for free. But in the Linux world, you can find them for very low prices. So it's a good way to, you know, uh, keep your business updated, use the really cutting edge uh, kind of uh, software and the spreadsheet systems uh, and do all the things that we, uh, we've been sharing with you here through the channel, you know, uh, use them on, on your day-to-day -day activities and without, you know, uh, using a ton of cash to, to buy all the software licenses. Okay, so, uh, this is what I, I wanted to share with you guys today. Please leave your comments and your feedback. I would love to hear uh, from you. And, uh, you know, keep visiting the channel. We'll be posting uh, new videos uh, twice a week, uh, every Sunday and every Thursday. Okay? Thank you. Bye.